Dental monitoring may well be the biggest change in the history of orthodontics. And if you wonder why could that possibly be, and, and, and as I think about the whole process of what dental monitoring is, and I'll talk to you about that in a minute, uh, it, it's clear to me that it's the invention of the smartphone. It's the smartphone that is actually changing the total way that orthodontics has been practiced. So what do I mean by that in relation to dental monitoring? Well, just imagine a patient takes their smartphone and takes a video of their teeth. No big drama, takes them 20 seconds or so. That video is lo loaded up into, an, into a, an app up on the cloud that uses artificial intelligence to analyse all the data. Now, as a result of that analysis, the artificial intelligence can tell the patient a whole range of things. Are the aligners fitting well? Should you change your aligners? Should you not change your aligners? Should you wear them for a few more days? Is your hygiene good? Do you have evidence of gum infection? Has uh, one of the tooth worn excessively? There's 170 something different things this artificial in intelligence uh, will pick up. Typically, if you have Invisalign treatment in my practice, you would have your aligners placed and you'd come back in 12 weeks time and you'd change your aligners every, every week for 12 weeks. So you'd be in number 12 after you've just started treatment. That was the best we could do at the time. But the problem was if something happened, if a tooth wasn't tracking, if something uh, attachment broke or whatever there might be, we wouldn't know about that. And we'd have to suffer the consequences when we saw the patient 12 weeks later. As I say to my patients, uh, uh, dental monitoring using artificial intelligence is like me checking your treatment progress and your aligner fit on a weekly basis at a pixel level. And they're the two key things. I'm looking at your treatment every week, not every 12 weeks, and I'm looking at a level that the human eye can't even perceive. And that's what, dental, that's what artificial technology uh, artificial intelligence can actually do. So the outcome of that for the patient uh, from a, a purely clinical outcome is that their treatments tend to track a lot better because little problems get picked up really quickly and managed very easily. So we don't have aligners fitting worse and worse over time. Treatment times are significantly shorter, significantly shorter when you use dental monitoring. The number of appointments that patients come in for uh, are significantly shorter. I've just done a presentation recently when we talked about a, a braces case that had 23 appointments, a really nice Invisalign case that went for 15 months and had uh, 11 appointments, and I was particularly proud of that result. And now we're in this innovative, uh, disruptive phase of dental monitoring where a similar patient actually had three appointments and 11 months of treatment. That's three appointments from the time we started treatment to the time we finished uh, with super high quality outcomes. So dental monitoring, if I sound a bit passionate about it, it is the biggest thing that's happened in orthodontics and I'm so excited about what it delivers to our patients, the quality of treatment outcomes, the reduction in treatment times, the reduction in coming to appointments, the convenience of the whole thing. It's, it's, just, a, it's just such an exciting thing.